Wow, what's up everybody? Once again, it's brand man, Sean, and I gotta talk about the fact that it does bring a lot of value to your performance if you start off practicing in smaller environments. Now this is the last video of a performance series that I started a few months ago. So just to get really clear on this one, we're gonna go over Ed Sheeran. We've touched on Bruno Mars, Travis Scott, for you guys who haven't seen the last videos, you can definitely check them out. I'll put the links in the description below. I'll even make a playlist. But when it comes to Ed Sheeran, a lot of people don't understand the fact that the guy started off in some very small environments when he was performing. Talking about the bars, speak easy like clubs late at night, just like so many other artists have started off playing. But not only that, this guy started off street performing as well. If you don't understand the value of something like this then just check this video first of all saying that Ed Sheeran really didn't think that he was gonna be as big as he is now my music doesn't really hit everyone um, otherwise I'd be a very lucky man it should hit some people today hopefully if you don't know the numbers we're gonna put some numbers up on the screen just to see his accolades the Grammys he has just the numbers he sold and you'll understand that he is one of the biggest in the game today for those who happen to just listen to one genre like hip-hop or country or something but back to the point of this video, the value of doing something like that is when you look at someone like Ed Sheeran, this guy does not jump around. He doesn't have antics. He doesn't crowd surf. Not much of that at all. He's really just a true singer, old school style. I sing and I really move you with my voice, but it's not just being able to sing your butt off because there's a lot of people who could just sing their butt off. Probably people would say they got better voices than Ed and all that kind of stuff. However, controlling and moving a crowd with your voice and really entertaining without having to move much, it, just being able to do that is a gift in itself, but it's also a skill in itself. Luther Vandross used to be amazing with it, man. He was too big to even move much at all back in the day. Adele does it very well. You see a lot of comedians that do this incredibly well and what comedians oftentimes start performing in very small environments. So don't rob yourself of getting a true performance experience, taking yourself to performance college by trying out performing in small environments, trying out performing on the streets. When, if you can stop people in the street, there's been quite a few people who have actually been street performers and become bigger stars. If you can stop people from their regular day life, that part alone shows you have something and then you really get the idea of how you can move and control this crowd i hear street performers say all the time a lot of them will woo people in with cover songs and then once they got them then they'll slip in one of their original songs and that gives them a crowd to test with you have people online they're just trying to get somebody to listen to their stuff but other people are getting real feedback in the streets by just giving some value, showing them a song or entertaining them however, and then next thing you know, they slip an original in. And once they do that original, they can get a vibe of, is this something I can get people to like for real, for real? Do people still enjoy or are they immediately leaving? Or are they immediately leaving? And how many of those people are immediately leaving? I know quite a few who are doing it. I've talked to quite a few people who are doing it and they're finding some interesting success oftentimes making a lot more money than a lot of the artists who are just online and saying they can't figure out how to make money. Give it a try. I would like to know you guys' thoughts on even the idea of yourself doing it. First of all, though, you know, what would that look like for you? Because I know some people see dancers all the time or you see people with instruments and even singers, but do y'all see rappers do street performances a lot? I've seen quite a few of them, but just put it in the comments. Give me your thoughts. As always, I want to know what you think. I'm going to get down there and discuss with you. And just a reminder to you guys, for the rest of the year, the rest of 2018, I will be answering questions on my Instagram page, at Shine on Sundays. So follow me and ask away. Other than that, if you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. If you like it, you might as well share it. And if you're not subscribed, you know what to do. Hit that subscribe button.